I'm going to be showing you how to get the Microsoft Office Plus 2021 package. It is going to contain all the packages, Excel, your Word, your Access, your PowerPoint and all of those. So if you're using the lower version of the Microsoft Office package, then this video is for you. If you have been having that product key issue, always requiring you to put the product key, then this video is for you because by the end of this video, you will learn how to install the latest 2021 Microsoft Office package and you're going to be getting access to this product for a lifetime. So you're getting a lifetime access to the Microsoft 365 Office package even without any renewal. This is amazing. If this is your first time on this channel, please hit the subscribe button, like this video and hit on the notification button because that is your own way of supporting this channel and also helping others to get this information faster. There are going to be basically three steps on how to do this. I am going to show you the first step, the second step, and the third step. Watch the end of the video. This is amazing. Come, let me show you. So guys, if you are using the lower version of Excel, like the 2019 or Bido, uh there are so many functions or formulas that you're not going to have access to that are in the in the newer version the 2021 version so if you don't have the 2021 version of excel you're going to find it difficult to do some certain calculations and formulas uh because some formulas are only updated to the new um 2021 version unless you're using the online excel sheets they have all the recent update any update that is dropped on a cell within that same minute it is going to be on the office 365 but if you're using those lower versions of excel there are so many functions you cannot now let me show you one of them like for example if you need to if you have something like john doe and you want to use this split function now you want to split these two names into two different cells maybe here you want to put the first name and here you want to put the last name right so now to split this text what we need to simply do is to use a formula right equal to text splits so we're just going to click on the formula then choose this particular text that we want to split then we we'll put our comma put our space the delimiter is a space then we'll put our close our bracket and hit on enter automatically is going to split the text for us as you can see so if you want to join it back, you can just come here and do equal to concatenate. You can do concate, then choose the first one, put your comma, then put a space, put a comma, then choose the second one, close your bracket and hit on enter. It's going to join it back for us, all right? So this is the Excel latest version. Then what if you want to use the Excel, this is the lower version of Excel. If we have the same thing in a cell here, and I want to do the same thing, I want to maybe put the first name here and put the second, uh, sorry, and then put the last name here, right? Now I want to do the same thing we did before. I'm just going to put equal to text split. Oh, you see, there's no text split, it doesn't have it. So I can't perform that function here because I don't have text split, all right? So uh, though there are other functions that I can use to do this, I can use text fill to do it. But this particular function is not in this Excel. There are so many other ones, even XLOOKUP is not here. Uh, there are so many, so many other ones, okay? So I'm gonna be less, uh, we are gonna be downloading the latest Excel version. That is the Excel 2021 in this video. First, before we start, let's check if we already have it in our system. We don't have any Word documents here. Let's also check Excel. We don't have Excel in this computer, right? We are going to be doing this in three different steps. So the first step you're going to take is to download Office Deployment 2, all right? And to do that, let's just head up to our Google Chrome or any of your browser. Then you need to search for the Office Deployment 2. So you just do Office Deployment 2. So you just hit on Enter and that's it. This first one, 
click on this one from Microsoft. Once you click on it, it's going to bring you to here. Now you're going to get this for one person. So just come down here and click on download. Make sure it's in English. Then click on download. It's going to start downloading. It's downloaded automatically. So the next one is to download the configuration file. So just come here and type office customization to all right office customization to just click on it and it's going to bring you here so you click on this first one then it's going to bring you to these uh points now you need to check your system the first one is to check your system requirements which architecture do your system deploy so if your system is a 32 bit system you have to select 32 bits but if it's a 64 bits you need to select 64 bits and to know how many bits your system is just simply come here go to setting just type setting here go to your system setting so when you come to this point click on home it's going to bring you home here so click on system then go ahead and click on scroll down click on about when you click on about it's going to bring your device specification as you can see here this is a 64 bit operating system it is a 64 base processor all right so this is a 64 bit operating system so you're going to check if yours is 32 bits then you know that this is your 32 bit okay so we'll go back We'll come here so i'm going to choose 64 bits because my system is 64 bit right so you come down to this office suit open this office suit here you need to select you come down here if your system is 32 bits then you need to select office professional plus for 2019 all right if your system is 32 bits you select office professional plus 2019 if your system is 32 bit but if it is 64 bit like my own you're going to select this one office ltsc professional plus 2021 all right select this one then go down so everything is okay here just leave it at default then come down here here is just to select the app inside your microsoft office package what are the apps you want inside so you select the necessary apps you want of course we want access we don't want skype we don't want one note it's not necessary we want powerpoint we want the word the word document and obviously we want excel we don't want one drive we already have one drive in our email we don't want outlook uh i think that's fine that's fine so that's all so you hit on next it's going to bring you to the language then you need to select the language right so click on this language and select united states english united states okay that's fine select additional language no don't do anything else just click on next so here office network everything here is fine just click on next so here you need to select office content delivery this is fine don't touch anything don't touch anything click on next here everything is okay here just click on next well, you can just keep this. It's not really compulsory. You can just keep it. Then here in this setting, these are the apps that you're, you're getting. All right. So you don't need to do anything. Just keep everything. Scroll down. Scroll down. You scroll down. Come to this finish. Scroll down to finish and hit on finish. All right. So when you hit on finish, everything is fine. You click on export. Come here. Click on export. And then here you need to keep the current settings, right? Just keep the current setting and click on OK. In the next page, you need to accept their terms and conditions. You know? So make sure you read all of these things really thoroughly. Then if you're OK with everything here, you just click on Accept and Continue. On the configuration, it's fine. Just click on Export. So it's going to start downloading. Our two files has downloaded, right? Good. So if come back to our system and we'll go to our download you're going to see those two files here as you can see they are all downloaded here right so our both files are downloaded the next thing we need to do is to come to our c drive so here you need to create a new folder right then click on folder change the name to office 2021 because we are installing office 2021 right so now go back to your download you need to cut these two files 
just click on cut or use ctrl x to cut the two of them come back to your c locate that file you created locate that locate that folder you created then paste those two uh, files here ctrl v now our files has been our files have been saved in our internal memory so the next thing we need to do is to click on this office deployment tool just right click on it then you see run as administrator you see run as administrator click on run as, as an administrator then it's going to prompt you to install the file click on yes it's going to bring up this licensing agreement you just need to click on this accept then click on continue it's going to ask you where to install this file in your system of course we need to install it in our c drive right so click on my pc this is your pc then scroll down to that file that you saved so you click on my pc then scroll down to your local disk your disk c open it then search for that office 2021 just click on it and then click on ok obviously as you can see it has file extracted successfully you click on OK. So guys, now that we've installed this configuration, we've done the first stage, which is the Office Deployment Tool installation. We've done the configuration installation. The third step is to set up this installation, and that is to install this software in our system, all right? So to do that, you need to use your command prompt. You need to be writing some small kind of code. So just come to this, your start bar, and type command prompt right so just type command prompt type it like this then hit enter it's going to bring up this prompt for you right so what you need to type here is just write cd space c column forward slash put the forward slash then office 2021 which is that office file I will save hit on enter now uh this is the file location you're just trying to uh, this is like a directory this is a file location of that file in your system remember we'll save it in the dc right that's the direction here now you need to run a setup for this uh, particular file look at it this setup that's what we need to run here now so we're going to put this setup dot exactly the way it is here put setup dot exe space put a space there then you need to put the backward slash configure because when we are trying to configure it configure space configuration all right then dot xml you need to put setup space forward slash configure space configuration so the next thing you need to do is just to hit on enter once you hit on enter the installation is going to start all right so let's hit on enter it's going to prompt you to install this microsoft 365 in office all right click on yes then it's getting the system ready to start this installation so you just allow it to start the installation properly guys as you can see it has started installing this uh, software in our system now look at all the packages it's going to install it's going to give us the microsoft word the microsoft excel the powerpoint your notes and all of that the access this is the access and all of that so it's going to take quite a while so you need to give you some time to properly install this file into our system but once this is done guys you are going to have a lifetime access you're never going to need to pay for anything no you don't need any key anytime nobody's going to be asking you for anything it is for life guys and it's amazing and you're going to be installing the latest 2021 version of this um, uh, package all right so let's allow it to install so this the, the installation is almost complete we'll just wait for a while
wow guys see what we have here installation is finished your office product is now completely installed you can now go offline or shut down guys this is amazing so it is completely installed you are all set office installed now click start to view your new app so we just close this tab close this one shut this one down so now if we come back to here and check word you can see that we now have microsoft word this is amazing it wasn't here before and if you check excel if you check access you see that we have access if you check all the microsoft 360 let's check excel you can see that we now have excel we can go ahead and launch a cell. Let's also check um, Microsoft. If you check here, you now see that we have Microsoft 365 Office. This is amazing. This is unbelievable. So you see, we can close here. Nobody's asking you for, you can launch it. Nobody's asking you for any license in any product key or whatever. Nobody's asking you that. You have access to these products for life, bro. If you found this video helpful please hit the subscribe button make sure you hit the subscribe button now subscribe to this video like this video please drop your comment so that we can know if this worked for you all right so our excel is working perfectly everything is working you have the latest excel 2021 if this worked for you make sure you leave a comment if there's any other video you want us to do for you please leave a comment in the comment section make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos like this thank you for watching see you in the next video